see all this area here it may look like a car park but this is where the concert's going on now just up I can pick out my finger on that bit of hillside there that's where all the locals come and um, watch the music concerts for free and the kind of people they've had on in the past have been Paul Weller Ian Brown and uh, some other fuckers but the very funny thing is them putting that music concert on goes against their own bylaws which they have posted around the place on the back of signs but if you want to come down here and watch your music concert for free don't pay money to the Tory Surf Commission because what you do is over that way there's a car park you park your car there and it's wet you'll get bogged in and you get sent to walk down here and in that dip where the main car park is that's where you have to stay and you have like some hot dog stands over there and all the other people sit around there in a soaking wet rain it was last time and a bit of sunshine and that silly Welsh bin not enough against her being Welsh or anything but uh, she thought she was a bit of a Disney princess didn't she after each song she's like do you like my new dress? don't you think it's pretty? I go back up backstage now and I'll change it for you and she come back out after the thing that she done like one song and got changed she goes oh I've noticed you're all standing in the rain aren't you? I just had the words with the people backstage and he said do you want me to cut the show short? Cut the show short? The poor little sis paid all their money to come and watch it and she says she's going to cut it short because the fucking dress is getting wet. Stupid bint in a frock. But like even this is pain display. But just up here, may as well show this for here because I tell you this boys and girls if the Forestry Commission had real rangers and they're really into the forest they'd have people like me showing you what you can do in this kind of place but I would never work for them because that would be treason I, I have most time for tra traitors but this is uh, another pine tree here and this stuff this is pine pollen still very young but once it gets thick like cones is about that big what you can do then is collect it, cook it, store it in jars and boxes and eat it Oh, that's like a superfood. That sends, that chills me up big time. That does. Um, I've never done cocaine, but I'll say this. I got talking to some guy, and I said to him, "I bet you've done cocaine in your time." And he goes, "Yeah, yeah, yeah I've done cocaine." And he's asking me where you can get ores and all that kind of stuff. I fucking said to him, "You are after some ores, are you? Go down to Ashness Bridge. No, not Ashness Bridge. The Grange, that little bridge. You know what I mean?" He's like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." I went round there. There's fucking loads of ores. Should see him. Well, sat there, big juicy ones. You have to go and give him a big thrashing with a stick. And he's, oh, check that out, mates. <laughs> Talking about the fucking hawthorn tree and the berries that you can eat and make these fruit levers. Because up there, that's all pale. Oh, that kind of land there, that's all newly planted. It's a bit few years old now, like, well, it never used to be there. But again, that's all pla plantation. It's all being grown to be cut out for corporations' greed. It's not there for nature's need. And now, oh, this is the thing that they get you with, this deception. They want you to believe in all that kind of tripe and pay and pay to come here and like get a change of wallpaper. But like most people that come here, all they do is like walk around and with a dog or on the bikes with the kids and things. Like nothing against them or anything, but I mean the mayors will put on a pair of virtual 3D glasses and sit at their home, sit at home and like pretend they're somewhere else and open the windows to get the breeze and like maybe get some fucking scratch and scratch and sniff fucking cars and pretend that they're fucking really taking in like the the scent of the forest and all that kind of stuff because I like, you know when the pollen's mixing and that kind of stuff but pine pollen yeah you've got to cook it to get all the nutrients out of it not like all the other pollens you can just eat from like certain flowers and things but that will require me to talk to you like loads and loads and all that kind of stuff I can't put it all on camera because like the battery either runs out or something intrigues me and then I'm off again like doing something off camera because some of my good stuff you never see on camera, you have to be there in person, as a human, not the person, because that's the legal sense, that's why you need to learn it, because you want to come here and do that, that's what they're trying to get you with, that's why I'm going to start teaching people how to do things around here, for free, well they can give me a donation, like, you know, but, uh, pound for p pound, for pound, yeah, wild foods overtake raw foods, and all that kind of thing, but, we need to get in there, today, that's the uh, other tree nursery, I like to call it. Fucking tree nursery. Kiss me fucking cave.